Here we have our new page open in edit mode. We've already selected a template, added a title emoji, and a header image. Now, let's scroll down and customize this page. Adding macros in cloud is now easier than before. Simply click in the editor and type slash on your keyboard. This opens a list of available macros. You can filter this list by typing any macro name or just select one. Nice. You can also add macros from the toolbar by selecting this plus icon here. Next, let's create and format a table. Select the table icon in the toolbar or type slash table. This will add a 3x3 three three table to your page. To customize it, you will use the table borders, drop down arrows, and the floating menu. Let's say we want to remove this third column. Select the very top of the column, and an X will appear. Select the X, and this entire column will be removed. You can also do this for rows too. Next, let's add a row. Select a cell, and a downward arrow will show up. Select the arrow, then choose to insert row. Looking good. There's one more way to adjust your table. When the table is selected, a floating menu appears at the bottom that displays table options. Here you can choose if you want a header row, as we have here, header columns, or add numbers by each column. And that's how to customize a table. Let's go back up to the toolbar to see the other editing elements. Action items add a task to your page. You can create to-do lists, add mention teammates, and select these checkboxes as tasks are completed. Links helps you add external content to your page. You can paste a link here, or add a recently visited page from Confluence. When a link is added, Confluence updates this to a smart link that cleanly shows the title of the page. Select the link to change the way it's displayed on your page. Next is uploading files and images. Here you can choose a file from your computer. Hold and drag the edges to resize the image. Select the image to adjust its alignment on the page. Next are app mentions. Select this and you'll see a list of teammates you can tag on this page. When you app mention a teammate, they receive an email notification when the page is published. You can also add emojis to your page. In cloud, you can now add your own custom emojis here or choose from the extensive library. Back to the toolbar. We already discussed tables earlier. So, let's jump to layouts. This helps you organize content on your page. Use these icons to change the layout columns. Beautiful. Now it's your turn to try. Keep the creativity flowing, and you'll be amazed by what you can build. Hey, you want to earn a free badge for completing this training? Take this course on the Atlassian University website. Click here, or check the link in the description to get started. See you over there.